Hi guys, uh, Marvin and Kidder back again um, for my new haul vid. I uh, apologize for being dressed up. I'm getting ready to work, so um, but I wanted to show you uh, the books that I picked up from my comic store, Midtown Comic. Cheap plug, I know. Um, but uh, definitely wanted to show you guys what I got. I got a good amount. Um, got some from Indies. Got some from Marvel, and we're gonna end it with DC. So let's kick it off with uh, the first part of the Conan Red Sonia crossover. This is Dark Horse and Dynamite. Uh, Gail Simone, Jim Zub. Uh, been looking forward to this uh, definitely since Gail has been tweeting about it all the time. Even before it was even announced, she said she was working on it. Um, next up, we're going to uh, the next arc for um, X. Uh, this is the part one of Marked for Death story arc. And no, Steven Seagal is not in this. <laughs> uh, next up, Greg Rucka and uh, Lazarus. Sorry about that, that's my phone. Uh, it's just been good stuff here. This is another one of uh, a title. Always recommend some other pick up. Next up, we move on to Dynamite. And this is part three of Justin Gray's miniseries, Lone Ranger, uh, Vindicated. Uh, I've been loving it so far. Making the Ranger just great. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, the next part to this. Move on to Marvel. Here we go, guys. All right. I have two, four, two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven Marvel books. Okay. Uh, we'll kick it off with. Uh, all new Captain America. Sorry, guys. This is uh, reserved for a friend. Um, this is the only book that the code is reserved for. Uh, no one else can have this but my friend Jeremy. Uh, I like the cover. You got Sam punching the crap out of Sin. Yeah, I know it's a, he's punching a woman, but she ain't no lady. All right. Next up, we have. Uh, I believe this is the last issue. Um, oh no, no, it's not. Uh, that's good. It's not the last issue. Uh, I just looked at the back and I saw it. The next issue, um, all new Ghost Rider, number ten. Um, looking forward to seeing more of Johnny teach uh, Robbie a little bit about, you know, be kind of like I said, be his Obi, his Obi one. Next up, uh, all new uh, Amazing X Men, the once and future Juggernaut. Chris Yost is on the writing in this, and this just has been great. This is this is one of the X Men series that continues to be just great. Um, I don't Marvel. I don't know what you guys need to do, but you guys better do something with the just X Men with the all female team because, like I said, that. The quality of that has just been going down, in my opinion. Um, Avengers uh, number 40. I uh, love the cover. Oh, yeah, Thanos manhandling Sam. Um, in four months, time out. Time runs out, Secret Wars. I guess that's what it's building up to. But I did scheme through this, and T'Challa does something in this. To a certain Atlantean, Ooh, boy. Okay. Uh, next up is um, Captain Marvel, number eleven. Uh, Kelly, Miss Kelly Sue DeConnick, still uh, writing this. Thank you, Miss D. Uh, next up, Daredevil. Um, Wade is uh, 
soon Wade's run of Daredevil will be over, um, does that mean I'm going to start reading Daredevil? No. I've always been a Daredevil fan, so I'm, I'm hoping they get someone who can carry the torch, in a sense. Because if not, then wait, Mark would have to come back and say, people say I'll pass the damn torch. I want my damn torch back! No, I'm just messing with you. <laughs> um, next up, another great series, uh, Deathlock. Uh, number four, Mr. Edmondson has just been doing a fantastic job with this series. Uh, this was my series of, I think it was for my Geek Awards um, series of the of the year, in my opinion, and it just started, like new series of the year. Uh, next up, we have Guardians 3000. Once again, these covers by Alex Ross are just, just beautiful. You know, these covers are beautiful. I think this is where we get to see what is what's going on with uh, Star uh, Starhawk and the rest. Next up, <laughs> this is an interesting cover. Uh, Miles Morales, uh, Spider-Man, Ultimate Spider-Man. Uh, we get to. I guess this this is part two of what more we need to know about Miles's dad. And last but not, oh no, no, excuse me. And next up we have Kurt Wagner, Nightcrawler, Chris Claremont, number 10. It's Nightcrawler versus the Shadow King. This has just been great. All right. And last but not least, yeah, I got it. Dun, 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 yeah. Uh, Jason Aaron's John Cassidy, Star Wars, number one. Um, this basically, for me, is kind of good because when Star Wars was with Dark Horse, I read a few of the books, but I never really was an avid collector of them. You know, so this is good for me to, so I'm going to jump on board with this. Uh, John Cassidy is one of my favorite artists. I love his artwork. Uh, I know people are now like, okay, how long is he going to stay on this title? And Jason Aaron's, you know, he's just a fine writer, you know. So that's all the Marvel guys. Besides go, besides uh, all new uh, Cap, all the other books in terms of codes are available. You know, just ask. I'm going to end this with DC. I got four DC. We got Grayson number six. I believe that's Dick fighting a Midnighter. That's going to be tough. Uh, next up, we have uh, Green Lantern Corp number 38. The cover is interesting, too. Yeah. Next up, we have. Justice League United, number eight, and I'm glad to see that Gavi's liking this. I'm gonna get you caught up on it, Ed. Don't worry, I'm gonna get you caught up on it. And last but not least, get over here. Yeah, Mortal Kombat X, number one. Uh, this is supposed to tie into the game that's coming out soon. So once again, maybe we'll get some clues into how certain characters are coming back, especially in the games like Kung Lao, Kitana, when we saw them die in the last Mortal Kombat game. Um, this is supposed to take place before what's going on in the game, but uh, they had two covers, the Scorpion and Sub-Zero. Uh, of course, I'm going to go with the Scorpion because that, that's my boy. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to reading this bad boy. So that's about it, guys. Um, I'll get start reading these guys, and I should have my review up by the end of the weekend, or the end of the week, uh, perhaps before Monday. But other than that, this is my and kid saying peace, love, stay tuned, guys. The Omni Geek High Lord of New York. We'll see you guys next time. Take care.